Hey guys, welcome to my weekly recap and stacking the shelves. Um, I have um, a few review books this week. I actually did not buy any books. I am doing good sticking to my book buying ban. Um, I just have far too many books and I'm really, really trying to stick to my book buying ban. Um, I do have a few books that are pre-ordered, but I'm really, really trying not to buy any more. Um, my poor neglected books that I've bought and haven't read yet need to be read. So, um, yeah, I will um, get right into it. I got a few um, digital review books, and I'm too lazy to get my Nook. It's behind me on the shelf there by the TV. Um, too lazy to get it and go through and show you. So, um, it's charging. But I got <laughs> um, Eleanor and Park by Rainbow Rowell. Um, I think that's how you say the name. Um, that one I got from NetGalley, thanks to St. Martin's Press. And it sounds really good. I um, don't really know how to explain it. Um, I don't really have the description right here, but it's two people and it's like a love story like finding first love type thing and, and it just sounds really cute um, the next one I have is gravity by Melissa West and I actually had my blog tour stop on Friday for that and I gave you two excerpts from it um, my review for that is gonna go up on Tuesday I actually got that last Sunday but I had already my video had already posted um, I either got it Saturday or Sunday, but anyways, I'd already done my vlog, so I didn't add it. So I added it this week. Um, I really liked it. It was a good book. So look for my review for that on Tuesday. Next, I got Uses for Boys. Um, that is from St. Martin's Press um, by Lorraine. You know, I don't even want to say her last name. I'm going to put it down there. I'm going to, like, caption her name. But um, Uses for Boys, that sounds like a really good book, and I'm so excited that I got approved for it on NetGalley, thanks to St. Martin's Press. So, um, yeah, that one comes out in January, so it's going to be a while before I review that. I think January, anyways. Don't hold me to that. Then I got a few physical books. Horrid Henry's Monster Movie. This is really cute. I've actually already read it to my daughter, and um, she liked it. And so um, my review for this goes up on October 27th, so next Saturday. It's a cute little book. It's got four short stories in it, and um, there's a number of Horrid Henry books. There's tons of them. Um, but anyways, um, this book was really cute. My daughter liked it. So, um, yeah, and along with the review for that, I have an awesome giveaway also, thanks to Sourcebooks, that will be um, going up along with that. And then I also have, from St. Martin's Press, Stolen Nights by Rebecca Maisel, I think is how you say it. Um, I absolutely loved Infinite Days. Um, I read that like what two years ago or something. I read it like pretty much like right when it came out and It was so good and obviously I wasn't blogging at that time But I loved it and like immediately after finishing it I was like dying for the next book and it seems like it's been like forever waiting for it. This comes out January 15th, but I Heard it is actually already available in the UK and you can order it from the book depository I think but um look at this cover guys Oh, of course, there's a computer glare. See, her dress is like smoke. Um, yeah, but anyways, um, dude, so excited for this. I cannot wait to start reading this. Um, I really, I loved the first one. I can't even tell you. Like, thank you so much, St. Martin's Press, for sending this to me. Um, yeah, I'm super excited to read it. So anyways, um, but that is all I have for this week. So I hope that you all had um, a fabulous week and I would love to see what you got and things that went on during the week on your blog. So leave me a link and I will check it out. Bye guys.